YouTube. It's me, Brenda. Um, today I'm going to do an update video. Um, and this is not, I guess it's a three year, three month weight loss update, uh, gastric sleeve update. And this is for the people that have gotten the sleeve and are years out. And I want it to motivate you to know that even if you have weight gain, you will be able to lose weight again if you are dedicated and you stick to your program okay so the last video i made was back in april almost three months ago and at that time i weighed 184 pounds okay so i'll just run down my stats right now um I was sleeved April 23rd, 2014. My highest weight was 297 pounds. My lowest weight was 175 pounds. And then, unfortunately, uh, my brother passed away last year, which kind of caused me to, um, you know, stop going to the gym. I ended up developing this addiction to Red Bull, even though I know we're not supposed to drink carbonated drinks. And so I believe that it was the sugar from the Red Bull that ended up causing me to gain, regain some weight. And so I got all the way back up to 201 pounds. And so on my last video, I think I was mentioning that I was going to be training for the Peachtree Road Race. And so at that time, okay, this might be TMI, but I'm going to share it because if you drink Red Bull or any type of energy drink or anything that has a lot of caffeine in it. I hope I'm not talking too loud. Um, I ended up developing a really painful kidney infection. And the only thing that I could think that it was from was the Red Bull. So I went online and, and researched it. And you can develop kidney infections from drinking anything that contains a lot of caffeine. So I made a decision to do away with the Red Bull. And so right away, I ended up you know, losing weight. I mean, even on my last video, I had lost, I guess, about 17 pounds at that point. And so, um, I guess I didn't realize how much weight I had lost until people started saying things to me. And um, I even walked into the nail shop a few weeks ago, and they were, like, so surprised. Oh, my gosh, what are you doing? You lost so much weight. And so I was like, I don't know, running, you know, like once I started training for the Peachtree Road Race, it just seems like more and more weight dropped off. Okay, so like I said, I've never been able to get under 175 pounds. Well, today I sit on the scale and I weighed 170.6 pounds. And so I say that to say I'm three years out. The lowest I've ever gotten was 175. I actually regained and got up to 201 which is like what almost 30 pounds and now I'm back down I've actually lost 31 pounds so it's possible even if you are years out from surgery if you just get yourself back on track you can continue to lose weight and get to your goal weight because my ultimate goal weight was 145 pounds and now I mean I feel like I can do it and so I just wanted to share that with you guys. I guess I could do a full body shot right now. Oh, I haven't done one of these in so long. But yeah, this is from the front, from the side, and from the back. And of course, my problem area that I really don't like is my arms. But I'm going to work on that as much as I can. Um... And other than that, that's all. That's, that's really all I wanted to make the video for is just to inspire those of us who are years out from surgery. Because I've noticed that um, there are a lot of people who end up with a lot of re uh, regain. And I've even seen as much as 50 pounds of regain. And um, I just wanted to say it's possible to even surpass wherever you were when you were at your lowest weight if we could just you know, get our mindset back in the way it was when we first, you know, had the surgery. So with that, uh, here is my three year, three month VSG gastric sleeve weight loss update. And I hope everyone's doing well. And 
I'll see you on my next video. Bye-bye.